me. All right, darn. <laughs> so it's it's been what twelve days of practice and stuff. Tell me about how the how the team is is performing as far as energy wise, and and it's got to be kind of tough at this point how to kind of keep that motivation going, or what's that been like? Yeah, um, you know, once you get into the middle of camp, it's it's always a uh, always a hard deal trying to get the energy, and that's that's with any team, any team in the nation. You know, everybody's out there working hard, mm -hmm. grinding in the heat, banging, you know, hitting each other all the time. So it's definitely hard trying to get the energy up, but uh, that's kind of what we have to do as leaders is uh, try to try to get that energy back up for every every day when we come out here because we can't waste a day. You know, that that August 29th game is coming up quick, so we can't afford to miss a day. What do you guys use as as motivation as far as you know, p picking up everyone and just keeping keeping that intensity and that focus going? Uh, just knowing that we have a big game coming up. You know, we're, we're blessed to be out here playing this sport, and uh, we have a big game coming up. You know, We can't ask to be anywhere else but here in Bulldog Stadium practicing, so we kind of use that as energy and motivation. You know, That game is coming up quick. You know, Like I said, there's no, no days to waste. Mm -hmm. A lot of these practices so far, they've been taking place in kind of cooler weather compared to what we're used to. Um, is, is that a is that a relief there, or do you wish it was hotter and, and you guys sweating it out a little more? Um, either way it goes, you know we're ready for it. Yeah, we have been lucky that we had some uh, some pretty good weather, but when we come in here on the turf, it gets pretty hot. Um, so I think we've had to deal with the heat a little bit, but I'm sure the next couple of practices it might start uh, warming up, and that'll prepare us for that August 29th game because I'm sure it'll be pretty hot there, and uh, we'll try to use that to our advantage, you know, when Rutgers comes in here. And how has camp been for you individually at this point? You know, how do, how do you feel like you've been performing? Uh, I think I've had a pretty decent camp. You know, there's always things you can work on from angles to tackling to, to coverages to, to feet work to eyes. So I think I've had a pretty decent camp. Um, a lot of it, I've just been trying to trying to coach up the younger guys, uh, teach them the playbook, the ins and out of it, and uh, trying to disguise better with the younger guys. Because you know I, I can I can do some good disguising, and I'm trying to pass that on to them. You know when to show, when to when to get to your spots, and. Uh, other than that, you know, just trying to make plays. I, mm -hmm. I feel I have a good understanding of the playbook, so it's time for me to just start stepping up and making plays instead of just being in the right position every time. And uh, speaking of which, how would you assess how Charles Washington's performance has been uh, at to the, up to this point? Charles, that's that's my boy. Uh, I love him to death. He's uh, he's out there always running around. He's he's probably the fastest guy on the team, and. Um, He's probably still top three fastest, and he has he has a little hamstring uh, issue, um, but he's been playing through it. You know, he's a tough guy. He's tough as nails. He'll run through a brick wall for us if we needed him to, and uh, he's been performing good. Like I said, he's all, all over the field making plays, yeah. and uh, especially at that strong safety spot, blitzing, running coverages. Uh, they're asking a lot of him, and he's stepping up to the challenge. He was saying back in the spring that learning the playbook was was his uh, – where, where he was having some issues with. Have you noticed him being more knowledgeable on that front there? Uh, he's light years ahead, uh, ahead of where he was in the spring. You know, he's, he's he's also helping coach the young, strong safeties. You know, I can I can coach the free safeties, you know, with my eyes closed. But uh, the strong safeties, you know, some of the things that they do, I need him to help, and, and he's taking that on uh, with no problem. So the playbook to him is coming real good. You know, we have great communication out there, and it's setting, it's setting a good tempo for, uh, for the younger guys to see how to do it. That's right.